Yeah, hey, I had to come back on here one more time, man. Boy, Aries, and y'all. Had to come on here one more time, show y'all, man. Like, like, look at all the juice that came from the watermelon rind. From cutting it, after I got the meat, after I got the meat, out the, after I got the meat out the watermelon. I said that about three times. I'm gonna say it one more time. After I got the meat out the watermelon, and I got all that watermelon, this was full with um with me cutting the watermelon down as close as I could to the green part. This was full. So this all the watermelon juice I got from just that one bowl. Hold up, let me pour this in right quick, y'all. Pour this in. Man, it's still a lot, man. I'm drinking this. This is my watermelon juice, so don't, man, I can I can do this. Just want to take that fuzz off of there. That little fizz. I just want to show y'all how much watermelon juice that came off just cutting it as close as I could to the rind part. Man, that juicer, that juicer was the best investment I done made this year, y'all. Did I buy this juicer this year? I think, yeah, I bought this juicer this year. So, this juicer was the best investment I made this year, y'all. Excuse the sound, y'all, about to tilt it down a little bit. But look at all the juice I got. All the juice I got from this. This was full. Oh, yeah, and plus the, um, Plus the cucumbers and the limes too. But four bottles of, four bottles, I think these 18, 20 ounce bottles. 18, 20 ounce bottles. So, damn near half a gallon. Well, add that up. Over half a gallon, man. And I still got probably four more bottles. I'm finna put this, I'm finna put the top on here. Put this in the refrigerator. This is probably about four more, four more bottles of juice, man. So, I'm gonna put this in the refrigerator and I'm probably gonna juice this. Cause let me see. I probably wanna juice this till maybe Saturday or something, man. So I still got plenty of juice left over, man. Like, and I got all that watermelon in the refrigerator, like a big thing full of watermelon meat. And this just comes from cutting it, you know that white part, see, cutting it as close as you can to the rind, man. Like a lot of people throw eat the watermelon and throw away the rind. Oh yeah, and please don't buy, please don't buy watermelon, excuse the sound y'all, please don't buy watermelon that's already cut up in the container, man. Cause I used to work in the produce department and you supposed to wear gloves, but it's hard to cut watermelon with gloves on, with gloves on, so I guarantee you, they not cutting that watermelon up with gloves on. And they breathing all over the watermelon. So just buy your own watermelon and cut it up and, and and slice it up and contain it, put it in the container yourself. Man, don't buy that pre-cut watermelon, y'all. Even if it come in the slices with the little with the little plastic wrap over it, don't buy that, man. Just just buy your own watermelon, cut it up. It already the watermelon already come in its own protective shell, man. So it's good. Every, I mean, you don't even have to look for no. Don't be trying to look for no organic watermelon, cause nine times out of ten. If you buy a watermelon like from Kroger or from the dude on the corner or something, I guarantee you it's grow here in Georgia. So it's gonna be it's gonna be straight. It ain't traveling all over the country and stuff. And by the by the time you cut it, it it's probably gonna be good. I have yet to buy a bad I, I probably bought one bad watermelon yes last year. <clears throat> but the rest of the time, man, all them watermelons were good, man. It's it, it's kinda hard to pick a bad watermelon, man. Well, I mean, I get my watermelons from Kroger. The big, man, they be sitting in the bin. The big, juicy watermelons with seeds in them. They have a lot of watermelons, no seedless watermelon, but it be a plethora of them. Like, people don't even hardly buy them, man. The watermelons with the seeds in them, man, like, that, I go one day before, the next day it be almost empty, man. So people be buying them watermelons with seeds in them, man, because the seeds got so many health benefits in them. Like iron, magnesium, protein. It, it's, 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 just look it up yourself. Health benefits of watermelon seeds. And look up health benefits, um, 
Look up health benefits of watermelon seeds and look up health benefits of watermelon rinds. Watermelon rinds, dudes, is like a natural Viagra. So, <clears throat> hey, um, what else I want to tell y'all? Oh, yeah, like certain fruits, like you can't avoid the seeds. So the seeds probably going to be good for you. But like in an apple, it's real hard to get to them seeds because them seeds are poisonous, man. The, the, the seeds that's in apples, I think they got like cyanide in them or, or something. But you eat too many what um you eat too many apple seeds and you'll you'll kill over, man. So that's why that's why it's only like two, maybe two seeds in the apple, and you really gotta bite down in the apple to get to them because you don't supposed to be eating them. But like in the watermelon, it's it's a plethora of seeds, so it's hard to avoid. So they healthy for you. I mean, if you can stand that crunch from the watermelon seeds, just go ahead and eat them and swallow them, man. But I just wanted to show y'all, cause I was amazed. Like, I thought I was gonna have to use both of these. I thought I was gonna use both of these to get, to get this much juice, but I only use this right here. So I just had to come back on here right quick, y'all, and show y'all that. And a boy, Eric's aunt, you know, like, share, subscribe. Nah, this ain't YouTube, this on Instagram. <laughs> Follow me on Instagram. Go to my YouTube channel. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. A boy, Eric's aunt. Everything a boy, Eric's aunt. I'm wearing my bracelets for um mental mental illness, mental health. Um, it's a lot of it's a lot of mental illness going out here, y'all. It's running rampant, y'all. So wearing my bracelets for that and and hey, it's all love, y'all. Boy, Eric's aunt, man. I'm out, y'all.